book 271. Good morning, good morning. Welcome back to Morning Motivation with Matthew Daniels. And today, I'm going to tell you guys about the three octopi and the three challenges. That's right, the three octopi and the three challenges. But what is Matthew Daniels talking about? Um... A long, long time ago, in an area of the earth that we call the Indo-Pacific portion of the Indian Ocean today, there lived three mimic octopi deep beneath the waters. These octopi hated one another, and they would often debate and argue about which one of them was the very best. One day, one of them said, We have spent too many days debating this topic. Let us end the debate with three simple challenges to determine who is best. For the first challenge, let us all go out and hunt a crab. Whoever captures the largest crab will win the first challenge. The other two octopi agreed, and they all went their separate ways to go and find a crab. Before long, they all found and captured the largest crab that they could find, and they brought it back to their living area. After they measured the crabs, it was determined that they all captured crabs which were the exact same size. And so, the first challenge ended in a three-way tie. Very well, the first octopus said. For the next challenge, we will see who can camouflage himself the best. Whichever one of us that can create a color pattern on our bodies that the other two cannot duplicate will win the second challenge. The other two octopi agreed, and they all began creating dazzling patterns of multiple colors on their bodies, and each time they did, the other octopi duplicated the color patterns exactly. The three octopi did this until they all exhausted all the variations of color patterns they could think of, and no one did anything that the other two could not. So, they concluded that the second challenge ended in a draw as well. Very well, the first octopus said. For the last and final challenge, we will see who can imitate and mimic other animals the best. The next animal we see to swim past us, we will all mimic its shape, color, and movements. And whoever mimics it the best will win the last challenge. The three octopi waited patiently for a creature to swim by that they could mimic. And soon, they saw a seal come swimming by fast. Immediately, two of the octopi contorted their bodies and changed their colors to mimic the seal, and they swam off behind the seal, mimicking all of its movements exactly. The first octopi, instead of attempting the challenge to mimic the seal, camouflaged himself and pretended to be a rock. As the other two octopi swam off trying to win the challenge, a pod of killer whales came rushing up behind them. And since the seals were their favorite meal and they were chasing the seal that the octopi were mimicking, the killer whales swiftly gobbled up the two octopi, thinking they were seals. When the danger was gone, the first octopi stopped pretending to be a rock and he gathered up all of the three large crabs from the first challenge. Then the seal which swam by approached him. Here, the first octopus said, giving the seal the three large crabs. As I promised, if you would only leave the part of killer whales over here at the proper time, I would give you three large crabs. The seal thanked the octopus, took the crab, and swam off. And the crafty octopus went back to living his life. And so, the morning motivation of today is the three octopi and the three challenges. In life, I have found that it is not only a waste of time to argue and debate with those who do not like you, but it is also dangerous as well. When we entertain those who mean us no good, we open ourselves up to be placed in very bad situations, even if we are entertaining them to prove we are better than them. Today, avoid the people who do not like you and do not seek to change their opinion of you. That way, you will not run the risk of being set up for failure by them. Instead, spend your time around positive people who care about your well-being and always strive to do that which is good. And remember, you are awesome, you are amazing, you are wonderful, and you are great. And you are going to change the world. I just hope I'm still alive to see it, family. I'm out. Good morning. To order books in the Morning Motivation with Matthew Daniels book series, search Morning Motivation with Matthew Daniels on Amazon.com. Or visit www.dandyandbigherm.com.